What's happening, fam? LAR movement still moving. Subscriber die trying. You see the thumbnail, man. Um, when you mad at the wrong person. Like, I woke up this morning. And before I did these videos, uh, while I'm about to do them, I see the, the clip of Will Smith. And I'm like, what is this? So I look into it. And I see what happened. And then he won an Oscar for King Richard right after that. Now, I'm not going to say that this probably didn't have a backstory because if I recall a few years ago, Will and Jada protested the Oscars and Chris Rock was hosting and um, he made some jokes about him. And mm, to me, it goes back to that. This one was a light joke because of the haircut. Really wasn't that bad, but I would think you know he probably will probably look back at it like you know what. Uh, and then I got it when I looked at the clip, he was laughing at first, and then Jada was like, she took it personal, she took it serious. And he's like, yeah, it's not that serious. Uh, the room was like, mm, joke fell flat, whatever. Will got up, walked down there, slapped him. Now. I got to just say it, like, did you slap August Alcina? Did you slap the other people who was talking crazy about your wife that was in Hollywood? No, you didn't. No, you didn't. Did you slap your wife for having you on camera looking crazy? Did you slap anybody in the family for making you look crazy on every Red Talk Table episode? No, you didn't. But you walked up to Chris Rock while he was live on TV working and slapped him. Unprofessional. And I think more of a soft target thing than anything. Now, because of the thing Chris Rock did prior to that, a few years back, maybe he felt like it was warranted. And, you know, I can understand that. But to win an Oscar afterwards and apologize for how you acted at the Oscars to everybody at the Oscars except for the host, mm -mm. nah. So... I got to say, man, you mad at the wrong person. You 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 are really mad at the wrong person. And, and, unless, like, you know, now if it comes out, say, his wife, you know, Jada Pinkett, actually didn't shave her head for, for Willow, but she shaved her head for, like, she's going through chemo or something like that. Then, and he's and he been trying to keep it under wraps. Okay. I, I can see it. It's a sensitive topic, you know, because everybody's thinking that she just shaved her head to shave her head. But I got to maybe she didn't see what I'm saying. Maybe she didn't. But and that would be family business. That wouldn't be nobody else's business. Thus, it will. The overreaction is like, mm, OK, I can see where that goes. But here's the problem. I don't think. If they had a different host who was of another race or or another size, like if they had somebody like The Rock hosting, I don't think he would do that. If they had somebody like Steve Harvey hosting, I don't think he would do that. You know, just just in my opinion, I don't think he would he'd walk up on the stage, start keeping my, because mm -mm, I don't think it would have been a back, a back history to it either. But I just don't think he'd try somebody like that. When I say race, I don't think he'd try somebody who's white like that on national TV. I think it's bad when you want to, you know, you got to, it's, it's a brother disrespecting another brother on national TV. And he probably could feel the same way. Look, man, your jokes, you know, they were a little bit more classy when you were talking about the other people when it came to us. You was, dig you was digging it in there. It's unnecessary. So, but I still think he mad at the wrong person. You know, because people are going to ask, well, like, what happened to that same energy with this person and that person and this person and that person? <clears throat> and what did y'all want Chris Rock to do? So haul off and swing on him in the middle of the, of the Oscars? He still got a job to do. It's unfortunate that he had to be professional under those circumstances, but 
will, man, you out of pocket. And, and it goes against your um, your persona. And I guess you're trying to let people know, don't let the smooth taste fool you kind of thing. But it was Chris Rock. You're not going to get any points for that with Chris Rock. Like, you're basically a heckler that went left. That's it. Like, it doesn't make sense. You know, it doesn't make sense to... to, to to make yourself look like that. And Jada, I mean, you got to be part of this problem because it was all good until you had that look on your face. It was all good until you had that look on your face. And now if you get, now I'm, I'm going to say this and I'm going to be done with this video. Now after this is over with, there's going to be a cooling off period. Still congratulations on a win and all that. But if your wife goes on Red Table Talk and a month from now she starts talking crazy about you again. It, it ain't Chris Rock. But like, share, subscribe, or die. Try and catch you on the next one. Peace.